tonight we take a look at the siblings of children with autism. How does it affect their childhoods? Once again, here's Melinda Spaulding. Nurturing their children's talents has always been a priority for the Panzer family, but they learned early on that not all nurturing is alike. Our philosophy has always been different things for different children. The differences between kids Robert and Jenny go beyond their favorite instruments, their favorite foods, or even their age. I'm 16 years old. Robert has autism. Jenny doesn't. I'm kind of used to it now. I mean, I've grown up with it, so I don't really think it's a big deal. Robert needs more therapy, more money, more attention from his parents. When I was younger, I used to take it personally, and I used to really not, I used to want a lot of attention, and he would get most of the attention. Their challenge, making sure Jenny gets what she needs as they pursue the best options for Robert, a challenge that's become easier with time. I took wisdom where I could find it. To Jenny, when Robert was very young, it, it certainly had to seem, and it probably was true, that he got a great deal more attention. Mm -hmm. But uh, I remember many times saying, but Robert doesn't get to go spend the night at other people's houses. You do. They soon learned just how strong the bond between siblings can be. All the time Robert was in therapy, the therapist would say, Jenny's his best therapist. Mm -hmm. And so I think, that, I think that makes it much easier if the other child isn't removed from the situation. Today, Robert and Jenny are just like any other brother and sister in their neighborhood. They go to school together. They tease each other. Do you like her driving? Is that what it is? No. <laughs> Jenny is not a good driver. But most importantly, they both get what it means to live with autism. I'm pretty understanding when he needs his attention. And when I need my attention, my parents always give it to me either. You can't walk away from this duo without knowing two things. Robert really admires his big sister. So Robert, what do you think of your sister and her friends when you see them at school? They look awesome. And Jenny looks out for her younger brother. We sometimes take field trips together. If with his class I can go with them and um, sometimes we see each other at lunch. Their closeness gives their parents a sense of reassurance and some concern. As Jenny prepares to go off to college. I want to go. But she's gone. For the whole year. The Panzers can't help but think about the future. I think you have to be concerned that she winds up taking more of the responsibility than other children would. Right now I'm investing or er, researching um, transition uh, services and, and issues that may arise as he gets older. Um, but I think Jenny will be a, a support to her brother throughout his life. Different things for different children. Melinda Spaulding, Fox 26 News. Currently, four families who have children with autism are blogging about their experiences on our website, myfoxhouston.com. You can find a link under the Health tab.